5. News from where you live. All month long, News 18 is commemorating Black History Month, and we begin with an in-depth look at life for African Americans here in the Hoosier Heartland. Tonight, News 18's Jamie Jackson explores student life at Purdue. For so many, their love of the golden black runs deep. As we honor the legacy and lives of African Americans at Purdue, we uncover the heart of the student experience. Construction continues here on the campus of Purdue University. A sign of progress, change, development. Over the years, the black community on campus has evolved, beginning with many firsts, from its first graduate of color, David Robert Lewis, to the university's first black athlete, Richard Smith, people who've paved the way for alumni like Leroy Keyes. My teachers in high school had already indoctrinated us. You're going to have to give more than 100%. Yours is going to be close to around 250. Because, see, the field is still going to be tilted, no matter how great you think you are or how well you're doing. Black alumni share numerous memories of historic moments that serve as critical turning points at Purdue. When the football team would travel, the black players couldn't stay in the same hotel with some of their counterparts, their teammates. So we said, enough is enough. So when we had our demonstration, it really brought Fred Hubby. It caught his attention. It got the attention of others on campus because Purdue had been such a tranquil place. Experiences of racial inequality led to the protests of the 1960s. Those challenges and sacrifices set the foundation for the Boilermakers of today. And sitting down with me, each share their own unique experiences. You can be the only black person in your class. Um, the only, and in my case, probably the only black male, if there's a female in my class, but the only black, the only black male in my class whose viewpoints is different from everybody else's. Um, my back I mean, I have friends from all races. I have friends who come from all different kinds of economic backgrounds, and I just look at them as the person, not as, oh, you're black, you're white, you're Hispanic, you're Indian, you're... Uh, Chinese, Japanese, I don't look at that. I think of it as, you're a person, I'm going to treat you as a person. And that's how I expect to be treated on campus and off of campus. Some feel more diversity and voices are needed. It mainly became an issue when situations would arise on campus and the opinions that surrounded me were those that didn't necessarily understand what it meant to be African American in America. No matter what background students come from, they all share one unified ideological idea. So I don't really think that there's like a black experience or an Hispanic experience or an international student experience. I just think it's you're coming here for your education and it's a Purdue experience. An experience that will evolve and grow as progress, change and development continue here on campus. Check out WLFI.com for a special black history section. There you'll find extended interviews and stories highlighting black culture and the black experience in Greater Lafayette. Jamie Jackson, News 18.